Hi! Recently, one of our email subscribers, Mr. Herbert Zella, pointed us to a very nice site called tinywow.com. When I saw this site, I was awestruck by the number of useful tools that were available in just one place, all of them for free, not even a sign up required. Let me show you some of the awesome tools available on this site. But before that, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com, the creator of Ram Gopal's PowerPoint Mastery Program, a comprehensive and creative PowerPoint training program for professionals. Now, just take a look at the number of tools available under each of these sections. For just PDF related work, we have more than 45 tools. For image related work, we have more than 30 tools, 10 plus video tools, 10 plus AI write tools and more than 15 file tools are available in this site. And I really love the ease with which each of those tools function. Now I'm going to demonstrate some very simple but very useful tools from tinywow.com. This video is not sponsored by anyone. It is just me spreading the good word about this useful site. First, let us go to some of the AI write tools. This is an excellent way to improve your productivity. Let me click on this. This tool solves all your text problems. So let us click on it and see what are the things that we have available here. You have paragraph writer, paragraph completer, LinkedIn post generator, blog post ideas, grammar fixer, blog outline generator, content improver. It is really beautiful. First, let us click on content improver and see if it actually can improve the content. Now to test that, let us go to presentation process site. I'm just going to pick up this text here from one of the pages and I'm going to place this here, your text. Let us paste it here and let us ask AI to generate a better version. I'm going to check this and let us see what happens. Here we got the result. Let us compare this to the original. Here I say in this PowerPoint tutorial section, you will find step-by-step -step tutorials to generate creative effects with PowerPoint. It says you will find step-by-step -step instructions to create stunning visuals with PowerPoint. This is much more vivid and much clearer than this one. Here it says we've also included videos so you can learn by reading the article or seeing these video tutorials. Naturally, it can be improved. The AI writes we have also included videos so you can learn by reading the article or watching these video tutorials. Definitely, this text is much better than this text. Once I like this, I can always click on download and I can save to device or save to drive. Everything is made very convenient. Now let us try and see another tool. Let us say I'm running out of ideas and want to write some blog post, but I don't know what to write about. I can click on blog post ideas and let us see what kind of post ideas are generated by AI. Naturally, I would write about PowerPoint animation. So let me write here. Who's the target audience? Let us say I want PowerPoint animation targeted towards teachers and let me say generate. In a matter of seconds, I got some very interesting options here. It says how to create a powerful PowerPoint animation presentation, how to make your PowerPoint animation really stand out, make your next presentation look like a Hollywood blockbuster with maybe I can just copy this and let me go to some place and paste it so I can see it. So make your next presentation look like a Hollywood blockbuster with this powerful new software. Create a slideshow for your students to show off their best work. Use animations in your PowerPoint presentations to engage and entertain your students. So quite a few very beautiful and very relevant blog post ideas. Even if I don't write articles on these specific topics, I can find a lot of inspiration from these ideas. Now let us see what kind of tools are available under video. I love this one called video to GIF. There is also an option to trim video. Let us go to video to GIF. The tool asks me to upload from PC or mobile. And this is a very interesting thing. I can upload from my mobile as well. And a lot of these tools work pretty beautifully on mobile. Before I tried this, I went to pixabay.com and downloaded this short video. You can see that this is the video. My presentation is going to be about COVID precautions. So that is why I chose this one. I then clicked on free download and downloaded the video. So I've got the video on my downloads folder. So let me go to upload from PC or mobile. And here it is. Let us select that and say open. Now the file is uploaded. You can see that this is the video. Now that looks good. Now once I'm happy with this, I can change the frame rate if I want and I can choose the video resolution 
and then I can say convert. And once again, let me say I am not a robot. And here we have the result. I can download it. This is the downloaded version. Can you see? It is a very interesting GIF animation. The same video clip is looped over and over again. The size is quite small, so I can use it quite nicely. I can crop it and that is one of the benefits of using GIF animation. I can reduce it slightly like so and I can place this to the left. When I go to slideshow, I can see my GIF animation on one side and it really is pretty beautifully done. Now let us explore some of the image tools. Let us go to image and I see a whole bunch of them. All of them are pretty beautiful and useful. Background remover, restore photos, profile photo maker, remove person from photo, AI image generator. You can actually give some text and ask Tiny Wow to generate an image. It works quite nicely. You can extract text from image and this is a very handy one. Let us use this one called as blur background. So let me click on that. Let me upload one of the pictures from PC. Let us click on upload from PC and let us go to pictures and I'm going to just download some random image and say open. Once again, you reinforce to tiny wow that you are not a robot. Now, this is the image with blurred background. Now, you might think that there is not really much of work done here, but you have this slider available that allows you to blur it to the extent you want. Now, it is at 1%. Now, watch what happens to the background here. It is fairly sharp here. Now, watch this. I increase now it is around 29%. Can you see here? It is beginning to blur. Let us go all the way till 100% and you can see that the background is extremely blurred and we only have the subject shown. Quite handy, isn't it? Let us see some of the PDF related options. Here you can merge PDF, split PDF, protect PDF, remove watermark from PDF and you can even convert PDF to PowerPoint. The only small issue that I found here is the conversion happens with 4 is to 3 slide resolution. Now I've gotten used to using 16 is to 9 resolution. So this doesn't work so well for me. But if you're okay with the standard resolution, then this PDF to PowerPoint converter is quite awesome. Finally, let us see some of the file tools. These are the tools that help you in conversion, like say CSV to JSON, Excel to PDF, Excel to XML. There are quite a few conversion tools that are available here which are all quite handy. So if you want to bookmark one site to access a whole bunch of tools without having to sign up or without having to have any limits whatsoever, then Tiny Wow is the right one. You can bookmark this site so you can access this site whenever you want. If you liked this tutorial, then you will really like this other tutorial that I put together that shows you how to remove background for free in a Windows app that you already own in your computer. It's a very useful video. You can watch the video next by clicking on the link that you see on the screen. Go ahead, click on the link, watch the video, learn a useful technique to remove background from your photos for free. I'll see you inside that video.